Hello, my lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be vlogging. If the title of this video didn't tip you off, I am going to be getting uh, I'm going to be getting my tongue pierced right now. Or in like 20 minutes. I've been wanting to get my tongue pierced for such a freaking long time. I've even talked about it in like videos like months ago or like maybe a month. I'm probably exaggerating. But I have been wanting to get my tongue pierced for a long time. My parents have been like really against it and all that jazz. So I've just been like, you know, really just going at it, like pressuring them. Not like pressuring, but like just like bothering them about it until they basically said yes. Basically what happened is I really wanted to get my tongue pierced and... Every time I asked my parents, they'd be like, we're not talking about this right now. And they'd be like, no, you're going to look bad. You're going to look like sleazy. And I was like, that's cute. That's fun. I love that. But I officially, my mom got so angry at me for asking so many times that she was just like, you know what? I don't want to have this conversation anymore. Just get your tongue pierced. And I was like, word. So I was going to go with like one of my friends or something like that and vlog these parents with them. But even though my mom hates me getting my tongue piercing, she still wants to be there for it because she's scared which is understandable. I even went to the dentist to make sure I didn't have like gum or like dental issues because apparently like that's a factor that can like fuck it up or whatever. And I don't have any, my teeth are perfect, which came as a surprise to everybody because we all know that Naomi does not always remember to brush her teeth, which we support, we love, we are proud of her for that. She is a great girl, but she is a little bit of a forget for, bleh, forgetful girl as well. So we support her in all of her decisions and I have so many clips on my phone right now because I'm making two separate projects for school. Maybe I'll post them on my YouTube channel. The first one is like a PSA about like mental health and the second one is like um kind of like a short film that I made. Like I wrote like a play or not like a play but like a film and I play like three different characters in it. It's only the first draft of it that I made so far but maybe I'll upload them to this channel if you guys are interested so comment below but anyway i'm really excited um i'm supposed to go out for like hot pot with my mom tonight and it's really really fucking good it's like my favorite food but i don't know how well i'm gonna be able to eat it now i was originally gonna go on friday but um my dad is in vegas right now and he's getting back friday night and my mom wanted to be there when he got back so she was like let's go sooner so i was like okay we can go tonight after we eat but then we remembered that um the same place that I got my septum piercing and my side nose piercing, even though it um it closed up, so it's not pierced anymore. But I used to have that pierced. You can see on earlier videos on my channel was at this place in Brooklyn. And I live in Brooklyn. We were gonna go like into like um Upper Manhattan to get it done, but I was like, why would we go all the way when there's this other place right here? So I just called them and they said that they were doing tongue piercings, which is a little hard to find because a lot of places aren't doing it right now because of COVID. This place is doing it. I called them. They said they were, but they close at 5 p.m. So I couldn't. I wouldn't be able to make it after dinner obviously so I was like Ugh, fuck it like I'll just go right now and I have class at 2 15 it's currently like one so I think I'll make it back just in time very excited I'll have my mom film it hopefully she does it correctly and the clip doesn't come out weird so <laughs> imagine like I don't even get the clip and you guys just see the before and after if that's what happens that's what happens but either way I just wanted to take you guys on this journey with me and I'm currently just doing my makeup because I'll probably make one of those little transition tiktoks and you know get them likes but i need to look cute in the first half so that's why we're doing this right now it's also really hot and humid outside so probably not gonna wear a cute outfit i'm probably just gonna wear like what i'm wearing right now actually no maybe i'll change we'll see the vibes i just put on a little lip liner a little mascara and now i think i'm good to get dressed and go so this is what i'm wearing it's very casual these are my shoes they're demonias if you're wondering gonna bring some sunnies because it's hot i mean sunny and yeah pretty much ready to go so i'll see you in the car you look great hey guys so we are on the way to the piercing parlor this is my mother Jiris over here that i was just telling you about mom what would you say is your opinion about this piercing that i am that your daughter is retracting or not retracting obtaining no comment no comments. It's a great message. From one to ten, how sleazy do you think I would look? Um, let's hope not at all. Let's hope. That's the hope. That is the hope for the collective. So now my mom is thinking about maybe getting a tattoo while we're there. Guys, tell my mom in the comments that she does not look too old to get another tattoo. Please. 
She has this little tree over here. She has a couple stars on her back and she has a nose piercing and a buzz cut. We all know she's a baddie. It's time for you to accept it, mother. Anyway, guys, I'm hoping I'll make it back to my class by 2.15, a problem that we often run into in my videos. This is not fear. Thank you. And if it was, <laughs> I think you're past 21. Oh, but you're driving, to yeah, be fair. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, that wouldn't have been the best. No, it's a Diet Coke. This is my mom's OG bet. Oh, no, I'm kidding. It's a Diet Pepsi. Anyways, we all know that in my videos, I often don't make it on time to my class because I do this, these videos right before my classes. So I'm hoping that we make it back in time. I'm very excited to have a lisp and I'm very excited to get laughed at. I actually have a little bit of a lisp anyway and a lot of my friends make fun of me for it. I don't know if you guys have ever noticed it in my videos, but it's definitely gone a lot better than it was when I was younger. I also used to have a space in between my front teeth, so I think that's probably why. No, but when I went to the dentist, everything was good with my mouth. Also, if you guys, any I of you- I think I know why you have a list. Why? You talk too fast. <laughs> All right. So as fun as this has been, um, I'm gonna be the only person in the vlog from here on out. Also, mom, you are gonna be recording me getting my tongue piercing and you have to hold no, the camera correctly. you're not allowed to. You're not allowed. Why would you say you're no, not allowed? No, 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 mom, no, you no, literally- I'm not gonna allow you. Mom, you literally you're record- You're underage. <laughs> mom, you literally- ah! Mom, you recorded me getting my septum piercing at the same exact place last I year. I know, but that you were legal. This is not- Why is that legal, legal and this isn't? I'm older now. All right, see, I outsmarted her. I don't even remember what I was saying anymore, whatever. No, but guys, this is very exciting for me. Um, also, in my class today, I don't even think I'm gonna be having to talk because we're doing like a film screening of the film I was telling you guys about, so I'll probably just have to like sit there and chill, which should be a nice time, which the collective appreciates. So I will see you guys when I'm at the piercing parlor. Last thing, I know I said I was gonna see you guys at the piercing parlor, but I have one more thing. If any of you have tongue piercings or know somebody that has them, comment aftercare tips in the comments or things that I should avoid doing because we all or know. Eating. Yeah, we'll or things I should avoid eating. I mean, we, we pretty much know, but we all know that I'm a little slow. So let's just give me some extra help because I think we all know that I need it. So thank you guys. Comment below. See you soon. I'm literally about to shit my pants. I am so scared. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm so scared. Get your drool, which oh, you probably will. So cute. That's attractive. <laughs> oh my god, stop. <laughs> After we'll be in the next. I'm sorry. <laughs> You see the bottom of your tongue? Oh wait, also, can I, do you know, like, can it be like not too far back? Like, I want it to well, be- Well, if you put it too far to the front, it's gonna hit your teeth. That's can I cool. show you an example of where I want it? Stick your tongue out. Take care. So we all witnessed that. It didn't hurt at all. Trigger warning, blood. I love it so much. I'm so happy. It kind of hurts to talk a little bit. Uh, uh oh. But my mother's a little. She's gonna need some time oh, to decompress. Spit, right? I don't need to spit. I can just swallow the blood. I have a napkin. Mm -hmm. That's fine. My blood is gonna give me a stomach ache, as if my bodies are already full of it. Ow. Anyway, I have to get on my class. I'm probably gonna have to join in the car because I'm running a little bit late. But that was a really good experience for anybody who wants a tongue piercing. It barely hurt at all. 
um, if you have a nose piercing, either one, a nose piercing is way more painful. It just felt like a pinch, honestly. And um, yeah, that was really fun. It only cost me $30, $10 chance, so $40. Um, it was a really good experience, and I really love the piercing, and I'll get, keep you guys updated on how it's healing, but... You should um, give his, the name of his business. If you live in Brooklyn, um, I went to a place called, this is the card, uh, Coney Island Biddy's Tattoos. That's the name of the place. Um, super cheap, super quick. You can just walk in. You don't need an appointment. So if you live in Brooklyn, New York, that's where I went. Or any pl wait, place in Brooklyn. Or, I mean, New York City. So yeah, that was my experience. I highly recommend this piercing. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching. And I'll see you again very, very soon. Goodbye from me and Jean.